Our team coverage continues now in Waterbury, where people are waking up both the snowfall and a school closure. This is a live look from our iCam there. And that's where we are joined by Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Caitlin Francis, who is in the early warning weather tracker one. Good morning, Caitlin. How are uh, things looking now that you're on the side of the road? Yeah, hey, good morning, guys. So we are outside of the weather tracker this morning. We parked in the DPW parking lot here in Waterbury. And I want you to take a look just by my feet because there's already about two inches of snow that have fallen on the ground. And we are, are as I mentioned, outside of the Department of Public Works. It's gonna be a pretty busy morning for those crews. DOT crews were out overnight. I saw some of those plow trucks just before 2 a.m. this morning getting that sand and salt on the roads. But for people thinking about maybe heading out to work, things are getting dicey, especially on those back roads. We're gonna take a look at some of that video of us from the drive over to Waterbury. This morning we saw quickly changing conditions. We went from 91 to 691 to 84, and then on back roads, things got progressively worse as this snow continues to fall here. That could also mean those school delays and cancellations for the kids. Not much. One to three inches is just a little bit of snow. Maybe there'll be a delay at school, so I'll have my grandson and that'll be fun. Yep, she is going to have her grandson because school here in Waterbury is canceled because of the snow today. Check the Channel 3 app for any of those delays and cancellations. And we'll be back on the road shortly showing you exactly what those weather conditions are like, those road conditions as I get pelted in the face with the snow falling here in Waterbury. For now, we are live outside the early warning weather tracker. One, I'm Caitlin Francis, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.